Hey guys, on today's video, I'm going to show you how to update your Mac to the latest OS. So right now it's 10.14.3 supplemental update that just came up. So we're going to, have to update this and it's not a huge update. It's going to take you guys about five to 10 minutes download and installation time. So let's just get this started right here. Your Apple logo on the top left hand side of your computer. Just click right there and your second option will be system preferences. So let's say you guys are in an older Mac OS. All your updates would actually be under App Store. But now with the newest Mac OS, it's always under system preferences. OK, so those are actual system updates that are always going to be there. So once we open that up, you guys will see this popping up. OK, so it may take some time to load this up. You guys can get more information just by clicking right here. You guys can see exactly what this is about. And if you guys click on the link, it will take you here. So you guys can see exactly what you're getting. So it isn't a huge update like I mentioned. It's only take five minutes for most of you, 10 minutes for some. It really does depend on your internet speed. And yes, if your Mac is slow, then it will take a little bit more time than that. But other than that, you guys shouldn't take more than that. Once you guys press update now, it will restart your Mac. So just make sure to have your files backed up and everything. Usually with updates, I always tell you guys to go up here and use Time Machine to back up your Mac just in case something goes wrong. And I would actually say to do that right now, just in case you guys haven't done it before, it's always good to back it up right now, just in case I do have a separate video showing you guys how to set up Time Machine. Time Machine is something free that's already in your Mac, by the way. Anyways, once you guys make that back up, just in case something goes wrong, some things can go wrong, trust me. So we're just gonna press on update now. What we're gonna see is a black screen Okay, so it's going to restart, then we're going to see an Apple logo, loading bar, and that's it. It's just going to restart again. If you guys have a passcode, type in your passcode, get in, you're done. And that's it for this update, okay? So, we're going to click on update now. So once we click there, you guys will see this, and it's a total of 1.85 gigs. Again, it does really depend on your internet speed, how long this will take. But for most of you, like I mentioned, it's going to be between 5 to 10 minutes downloading plus the installation itself anyways that's it for this video tutorial if you guys have any questions comments you guys can write them down here in the comments area don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you